is going to have a fit when I tell him I've been to see a solicitor. Let him. And it just goes to show how serious you are. And they put me through mediation first. See if we can agree amongst ourselves what's best for everyone. Mm, he's not famously brilliant at compromise, is he? He's not famously brilliant at much. Oh, he's all protective. <laughs> I'm going to keep it on the down low about the solicitor. I don't want to rile Kane if I don't have to. He'll just have to lump it. I've got to do what you've got to do. Oh, all right, slacker. Any chance of showing your face up at the farm this morning? Some of us have been there since dawn. No, there's absolutely no chance of that, mate. I'm officially unemployed. Well, we're not spoken to you then. This makes things worse. She's got through about a ton of bleach. She won't sit down. She's not sleeping. Well, maybe he needs to take her to the doctor's as well. Yeah, maybe. I don't know what to do. I'm guessing you two haven't cleared things up, then. You guessed right. It'll be all right, Sam. We'll get us sorted. You're going up with Chaz. And I'll cover till Bob gets here. And don't look so worried. Talk to her. I've tried. Try harder. Debs. You got a minute? No, I'm busy. I thought I was doing the right thing and I got it wrong, but I apologised. No, you started to apologise and then you lost the plot, as you always do. You just made things worse, Kane. I know what Debbie's like. It's like talking to a brick wall. She doesn't want to wear it. You might as well save your breath. You got a problem? No, no, not at all. No, I'm just uh, clearing glasses. Don't take it out and bob. Pick on someone your own size. Oh, well, this is cozy. I'm just grabbing the sandwich, Pete. That sound. Cos I've just had mine in the combine. You know, I thought I'd better crack on, seeing as I'm the only one that's working. What are you doing here, then? Keen. I'm looking for you. Cos I want to know why we've lost our best farm and we're harvesting round the corner. We can't pull in the harvest on our own. But even if the weather holds off and we don't sleep, we're still stuffed. I know. But we need Nate back. Do we? I mean, he was really stroppy and difficult. So you fired him for that? No, I, he walked out before I had the chance. And, and him and Kane were locking horns every five minutes. Obviously, it felt too much like hard work. Ah, so it was his fault. Oh, I wasn't seeing that. But, well, not entirely. Well, you didn't exactly make Nate feel welcome, did you? Well, it makes it back him a cake. No, I want you to back off and leave the farm into the farm. the people who've actually got a stake in what's going on. Like... We'll try and get someone else in. What, this time of year? No, you should be so lucky. Because anyone that's good is already employed. This ought to be fun. Just don't do anything stupid. Like I said, I promise you, we'll sort it. Yeah, you better. Involved in? I think the lock were in a room and let we thrash it out between ourselves. <laughs> it's going to be fun. Two men enter, one man leaves. <laughs> I'll come with you if you like. Yeah? Thanks. But I think it's just parents and solicitors they want. You're a big softie, really, aren't you? <laughs> I can't fight my own battles. I'm not saying you can't. I know, but you didn't sign up for this. I can talk about something that isn't directly Kyle-related at a push. If it's important to you, it's important to me. Mm, you massive melt. <laughs> I think it's better for me if we keep it out of the courts. And if that means trying mediation, then I'm happy to give it a go. But if that doesn't work... Which, let's face it, is Bucky's favourite. Then I have to crack on and make an application of residence. Yeah. Hiya. Hi, yeah. Hi. Oh, great. That's all we need. It's shame Debbie's not here just to add to the atmosphere. Well, we can go somewhere else. How much do you need him back on board? <laughs> Fine, at least I can fix one problem here. No, no, can you Excuse just... Me. Can I have a word? Free country, isn't it? They need you back at the farm. Well, then why aren't they asking me? Maura told me what went down. Look, you and me, we're never going to be mates, but your contact's with Maura and Pete. There's plenty of work there if you need it. I don't want to leave anyone in the lurch. Guess I'll be seeing you first thing. Okay. 